I just got the Apple Vision Pro, and later in this video, I FaceTime J-Man, try out a bunch of other features, and try to play Gorilla Tag. But let me take you back to whenever I first heard about it. It was June 5th, 2023, and I was visiting Montreal to see Julian. When we remembered, Apple had a huge announcement that day, not even knowing that they were going to announce a headset. I believe that augmented reality is a profound technology. <laughs> we watched the premiere, and after they said that it was going to be a headset, we made some bets on the prices. Alright, what, what are your price guesses? 5k? I say 1800. And once they showed what it was capable of, we knew we had to get one. Then they said it'd come out eight months later, and now we're here. I pre-ordered it a couple weeks ago, super excited to see what the future of VR would look like, but I was not ready. And yesterday morning, I woke up bright and early and headed straight to the Apple store to pick up the headset. We are here picking up the Apple headset. There's also no one near. And no, I don't live in a ghost town. It's just a big parking lot. I walked in six hours before my scheduled appointment. Yes, six oh! hours. I'm here to pick up the Apple Vision Pro. What's your name? Haven. I know, I know I'm pretty early, but- But they said they can get it to me earlier than my appointment. And after waiting and waiting, it was ready. Got the Secured the package and went straight back home for the big reveal. <laughs> Let's unbox. Also, please subscribe because my pockets are hurting now more than ever. All right. All right, let's get one thing straight before we start. I'm not Marquez Brownlee. I'm VMT, and I'm here to get straight to the point and just try out the freaking headset. One thing, though, that I love about all Apple products is the unboxing process. It's always something super satisfying. Just this is uh, very tightly in the back. Like, I literally can barely put my hands in between. All right. So this is how we're going to go about that. We're going to do it my way. Oh. oh. This looks so clean. It's it's pretty huge. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, it's time to unbox it. So I started unboxing, peeling the two strips off the sides of the box. Oh yeah, no tears, no nothing. Just a perfect pull. Oh, I love Apple. I love Apple products. All right. Okay, get out of here. Get out of frame. Then letting the rest just slide out. Now, I'm pretty sure we just lift the lid. I hope. What? Look at this thing, chat. Oh. Ooh, it's got that nice unboxing smell. That probably sounded very weird, but if you know, you know. Look at this thing. All right, so now, obviously, here's the headset. I want to be very careful with this because I did not buy Apple Care, so we should take care of it. My audio is a little iffy, but bear with me. Oh, okay. Real quick note, that is very front heavy. I hope my audio is okay. I'm gonna hold my phone right here just so you might be able to hear me a little better. But anyways, like I said, this is very, very front heavy like very front heavy but that's to be expected when there's nothing on the back and then everything on the front and that's why you have the external battery which i didn't get <laughs> okay so we have the actual headset and then this is the cover move that dude the packaging is just mm, mm, it's to die for and like i said i love packaging okay let's open this up uh this has excuse me come out thank you Please let go of me. Uh, I guess this is the manual. Oh, okay. If you're gonna give me a book, at least let me open it. Like it is literally like, come on, come on now, babble. All right, it's just a bunch of pictures, how everything works, nothing too crazy. Okay, this don't smell good. I don't like that one. Next, we got designed by Apple in California. Oh, this is the thing to clean it. There's that. What's this? The dual loop band. Oh, okay. This is the different, Um, yeah, this is the different head strap. So this head strap goes across the top of your head. So it takes off a lot of the weight. I heard that that one's better. We'll try out both. Oh, what? Okay, guys, listen. I'm not gonna lie. So the external battery is like an extra thing that you can buy, Uh, you know, to charge it extra. It's like an extra like $200. And I'm like, frick no, I'm just gonna charge it and then use it. Guys, they put one in the box. There's one here. Yeah, little did I know, I already had one. It was just an extra option. Look, <laughs> I got one. I ain't mad, and I ain't gonna say nothing. But look, if I'm paying four thousand dollars for a headset, you better give me an external charger. If it's only gonna last an hour, got a little carried away. Anyways, this is a cool charger. It's external, goes into your pocket. It's actually pretty heavy, but it goes into your pocket and it charges through the little thing. All right, charging, charging, charging. The block, cool. All this stuff, whatever. I'm just showing all this. Oh my gosh, I'm not gonna go in depth on everything. Don't worry. We're about to open up the headset, y'all. And then this is the okay. So this is the headband, or not the headband, the the face thing. All right, we're taking this thingy out. I don't know how to act actually get it out so i'm just gonna rip it all right trash 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 kind of kind of trash and after getting rid of all the trash we ended up getting the headset the dual loop band the cover the battery the light seal cushion the polishing cloth and the charger cables now 
let's focus on the reason we're here the apple vision pro i'm being very gentle with this all right there's a lot of actual unboxing to do so give me two seconds yo that feels mad comfy oh that feels mad comfy the second i laid my hand on the cloth it was super soft and super stretchy oh my gosh trash you know how we do it yo that is so soft all right i'm gonna take off the front and we're gonna reveal the apple vision pro look at this guys yo bro i feel like i'm in 2040 it's so shiny it looks beautiful much more futuristic than any other headset i'm gonna put on this headset now is it even gonna be charged i hope so here we go this is so crazy i don't even know how to react dude oh it's so comfy it's falling off my face oh okay that's tight like cool tight you know what i'm saying okay but how do i turn it on i swear if it's dead hey siri turn on but to turn it on i tried pressing all the buttons talking to siri talking to jarvis jarvis do we have power and reading the manual it seems to be dead maybe i should read the manual let me just check real quick we're in all right now we're gonna put it back on okay we're gonna tighten it <gasps> wait it's turning on oh my gosh can you do i look cool do i look cool tell me if i look cool oh my gosh wait wait i i feel something happening or not feel I wish I could have shown you guys the setup because honestly, that was the most fun part. Okay, okay, okay. It says press and hold to align, but I want the voiceover. One, two, three. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. And I have some bad news. So I'm going to keep this review as real as possible. During this recording, I kind of felt like the Quest 3 pass-through is better until I checked it out after the recording and realized the Apple headset's definitely much better. It's just the motion blur that you get that really throws you off. Now, the setup of this VR is actually really cool. Press digital crown to begin. Bring iPhone or iPad in your body to get started. It automatically adjusts the IPD the second you put the headset on it scans your hands and then you do an eye tracking test look at the dot and tap your fingers together to select it i will admit that's impressive the response timing in which like my eyes and like the act like it tracks your eyes right like where you look it is instant where you're looking the eye tracking on this headset is very impressive definitely Not my bad. favorite part about the headset next i set up personas sona beta okay so this is how i'm gonna look in facetime which is a little character that shows up whenever you FaceTime somebody. You look left, right, up, down, do some facial expressions, then you're done. That's so crazy. All right, it's creating persona. So yeah. Yo, that's me. I wish you guys could see this. How do I show you? Don't worry. It's not much longer until I figure that out. You have to go into the menu, to the control center, and then turn on the screen recording. We should be recording. Hello. I'm going to be recording my audio on my phone just in case it's not recording, but I think we're good now. I was searching around like everything. Yeah, record my view. Awesome. All right. Here we go. Okay, so here's my pass through. Here's what everything looks like. Yes, here's my everything. Uh, yeah, a, a lot of a lot of stuff is going on here. Okay, I get it. It's messy, but anyways, here's the real cool thing. Okay, you can see my hands. You can see what I'm doing. I can put my hands down here on the table and look. Okay, so you see how it's tracking my eyes. You see all the apps moving around. TV, freeform, mail, messages, just looking everywhere. And watch, I can pinch my fingers from here, and it'll click. Like that. That's pretty cool. Now, what I want to try, I'm gonna try and FaceTime Dreamer. Wait, I'm gonna message him first. Is there FaceTime? Where's FaceTime? There he is, FaceTime. I'm gonna tell him to pick up my phone call. Okay, I think he's gonna call me back in a second. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> I know, bro. <laughs> I can rescale. Wait, screen record on your end too, if you can. This is what he sees. Warning, it's kind of unsettling. No, but I'm not 100% sure. That's so creepy. Then I shared my screen so he can see what I was experiencing. <laughs> Wait, can you see, can you see my screen? <laughs> look at you. <laughs> then he told me he wanted to see more of the headset, but no spoilers. Dude, look. <laughs> okay, so I have messages and stuff, and I can, you know, answer you. Tracking, I'm going to blur all this, but the eye tracking is... <laughs> okay, well... <laughs> You're in the back. One thing I hated, which I don't know if you've you realized yet, but it doesn't record FaceTime right, audio. Alright, whatever. Fine. Wait, I'm gonna make you bigger. Oh, wow. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. Dude, you're like right in front of my face now. Nor my mic Look audio. This. Is it, is it like a blurred square for you? But maybe I just haven't figured out how to yet. Yeah, okay, so let's go into an environment. But then I tried the environments. Whoa. Okay, so if we scroll this way. Okay, if we scroll this way, it becomes less immersive. Okay, so now I'm back in my space. And I'm like, dang, man, I hate my room, man. I don't have a window, man, but I want to see outside whenever I work. So what do I do? Spin the, spin the wheel. Look, see, it's going to like slowly get more and more immersive as I spin it. Whoa. Okay. I was not expecting my hands to be here. That's pretty cool. Okay. The graphics are 10 times better than the Quest. I just think the pass-through could be a little better. That's it. That's my only note. Then I found a dinosaur app thing. Encounter dinosaurs? I don't know if I want to do that. Loki, an Apple original. Oh my gosh, the butterfly. Wait, can't I like put my hand out? Oh my gosh. Look, 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 look. I've seen this in the Apple TV thingy. Oh my gosh. Oh. 
I don't know. No. Get back here. Get back. What the frick? Never mind. You can stay over there. Where are you going though? Oh, little but. Who are you? Oh, he's struggling to get up. Where's your mom? Oh, oh hi. Oh, my fault. Hey, do you? Is that your mom? What you running for? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, oh. Wait, what if I do move? Oh, do I? Oh, oh, that's creepy. Oh, frick no. Oh, frick no. Oh, frick no. How you doing? Look, can I pet you? Can I pet you? Oh, no. Oh, okay, okay. What's over there? Can I pet you? I'm just gonna. Oh, oh, look at little. Oh. Hey, watch out for bro. Oh, they finna fight? Away from my, away from my house, bro. Chill out, y'all chill out. No, not for me. No, look, listen. Don't come for me now. Look, I'm just telling you. Don't fight my. Oh, my boy. Go. No, the window's closing. No, come give me some damn. No. Then I was never to see Rexy again. And now what everyone's been waiting for. All right. Now my main question is, how do I play Gorilla Tag on this thing? I'm gonna look it up. How to play Gorilla Tag on the Apple Vision Pro. This was the first video that popped up to help me and he seemed to have the same issues. Okay, skip. All right, so a couple of days ago, Apple revealed the new headset. Yeah, I Apple ordered one of them. I'm wearing it right now, actually. And while, will you be able to play Gorilla That's what I'm saying. To that, you won't be able to play what? On Google, will you be able to play games That's what I just Apple did. Yes, huh? you will be able to play games on the Apple Vision okay. Pro. Okay, he says they didn't use any controllers. Oh, there wait, you're right. I have no controllers so you're telling me i can't play gorilla tag on this thing nah 